How do you get out of a trunk when he's coming from behind? Okay. All right, guys. So uh, we're going to continue on with our grappling series, right? And uh, <laughs> we're going to take a look at a common uh, thing that people keep asking about, right? This rear choke. Now, there's a couple of ways to do this, right? He can catch me in the crook of the elbow and you get more of a blood choke. What uh, Chris had on me here was more the, the uh, bone in here crushing in on the windpipe. Either way, this is all gonna be good. So we'll take a look at this. I'm gonna shift in, right? So he comes around. First thing I'm gonna do is drop my jaw. I'm gonna get my jaw in here to protect the airway, right? A lot of people, and this is good, you're gonna pull down to try to protect that airway. I'm actually reaching in and catching a pressure point on the arm. And from here, we're gonna roll out and just start slamming into those ribs, right? Make him let go, okay? Make it hard for him to breathe. But take, it, take advantage of flinch response, okay? So one more time, go down, shift, roll in there, start slamming, move away.